Oh, man. The only thing that keeps sticking in my head, man, is Taraji P. Henson, man. And, and that's the only person, that's the only Uber ride that really bothers me. Is Wait, because, Taraji P. Henson, what happened? Uh, you know who that is? Of course, Baby Boy. Uh, yeah, well, uh, okay. Or, I'll, or, or Hustle okay. Flow. Yeah. Yes, yeah, see, okay, and Empire now, you know what I'm saying? Yep. So, but, uh, what ended up happening? Okay, all right. Long story short, I was, I, I was I went to uh, I went to this hotel to pick someone up, and Uber, of course, the Uber app does not give you sometimes, and sometimes it's the person too. So I, um, so this is related to your uh, the whole thing. Mm-hmm. So sometimes a person will actually uh, request a ride, but before they request a ride, they will actually put their finger by accidentally, like, moving the, the uh, their pen, and they would move it to a different spot. And when you get to that spot, they get upset with you because they think that you're an idiot and you don't know what the fuck you're doing and you don't know where the fuck you're going. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> so, so they normally cancel your ride. You know what I mean? Well, I had one with Taraji, you know? <laughs> and I just want to tell her. I told her in the car, but, I, she, you know, when you're mad, you don't want to listen to shit. You know what I'm saying? So, so my whole thing was, I, you know, I went to go pick her up. I didn't even know who she was at first. I mean, I know who she is, but I didn't recognize her. And she's beautiful without makeup. I just want to get that out there. She's beautiful. <laughs> I, I went to go pick because I was, I was waiting in front of the hotel, but apparently this hotel, you know, it's pretty extravagant and it has a side entrance where like limos and, and I guess Ubers drop off and pick up and I had no clue. The address said it was, you know, this one street and I looked at the address, I saw it, I was out front, there was some stairs and she called me like, Hey, where you at? And I'm like, Oh I'm right here. I'm way I'm downstairs, so I'll just be right here. She was like, Well I'm out here <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So she kinda of, it, it it ain't her fault. It was my fault for being kind of an idiot because the area where you're supposed to turn in, it was a uh it looked like a, a alley. Almost. It was cobblestone, though. It, it, I just thought it was an alley, you know, because it was the side of the hotel, not the front. So uh, the side was actually the front, and the front was actually the side, so I didn't know that. So I went around the block, and she waited 10 minutes for me. <laughs> and instead of canceling the ride, she waited for the ride to <laughs> tell me how she felt. <laughs> Wait, she said that's why she waited and didn't call a different one because she wanted to tell you how she felt? No, no, no. She didn't say that, but that's the way I, I felt. I felt. Okay, that. I got she you. Didn't say that. <laughs> Cause I was so like, you get in the car. She gets in the yeah. car. And now what? And then I'm like, you know, I'm starting to head to her destination, and she says, "No, there's a change of plans." I was like, oh, shit. <laughs> I was like, oh, okay, well, wherever you know, I'm still trying to. I was still apologizing. Keep in mind, I'm still saying sorry and sorry because I didn't know, but I didn't even know. At this time, I still didn't know who she was. So I just thought it was this cute-ass girl in my car. You know what I'm saying? So I was Wait, at like, what point know, did you realize it was her? When I had to take her to the Lowe's Hotel on Hollywood and Highland. And when I rolled up, because she kept saying, before we got there, she said she's not going to go out with her friends no more because I made her late. And I was like, no, okay, I'm late. <laughs> still go with no friends. I said, well, you need new friends if the motherfuckers can't wait for you 10 minutes. <laughs> it's like, damn, that's rude. You know what I mean? That's wrong. <laughs> so she was like, there's a change of plans. So when we went to the uh, the hotel over there on uh, Hollywood and Highlands, all she did was crack the window to where her eyes showed. So her eyebrows and her <laughs> eyes showed. And I remember her saying, Miss Henson, we'll go get your bag. <laughs> and then they brought down some Louis Vuitton luggage and I was like I got out the car to help put that shit in the trunk I was like who the fuck is in my car <laughs> like, you know what I'm saying cause not every time you know you don't get people with your Louis Vuitton luggage like that you know what I'm saying mm-hmm. I was like damn so I, I, I happened to turn around and look and I was like oh shit and I realized who it was and that's when I was like man you know I, I, I really don't want you to have a bad night and I can still go with your friends <laughs> you know what I mean? She was like, nah, that's okay. And then I ended up taking her to another hotel, and, and I I helped her with her luggage out the 
out the car, and that was it, man. And I, and I felt real shitty. You know what I'm saying? I, 